Hi guys, happy new year. Hopefully you've had a lovely new year and a lovely start to the year and I wish you guys all the best for a lovely, amazing, peaceful year ahead. Um, so uh, this year, one of the things I want to focus on is self-care. And so I bought a beauty product. I've actually had this for a while um, in my little to try makeup pile. But I thought this makeup skincare hybrid product is what I need in 2024 as if you've followed my channel for a while you know how much of a lip balm addict I am is because I have like naturally dry lips as you can see like when I was trying to get ready for this video the amount of times I nearly put my Laneige lip mask on is beyond me because that's how dry my lips get and I literally use the Laneige lip sleeping mask as lip balm that's how dry my lips are so when I came across the refined lip buff product and I thought that's a bit of me and if it says what it does and gets rid of all my um, dry skin and sets me up for the day then that's what can I what what more can I ask for so let me quickly see what um, Refi say about their lip buff so it's a Refi lip buff exfoliator and it retails for £14 which is not too bad for a lip balm exfoliator product. The clear serum contains a plant-based plumping agent which gives you a naturally fuller lip plus amino acids and a complex of five hyaluronic acids to help keep lips feeling nourished and hydrated. Lip buff is clinically proven to improve moisturization by 18%, reduce moisture loss from the skin barrier by 31% and increase lip volume by 13 percent 3%. The unique applicator is designed to buff the lips, removing dead skills to keep lips smooth without any abrasive particles or microbeads. The weightless serum will quickly absorb into the lips, leaving them smooth and hydrated. That is very, very appealing. Hopefully it does everything it says. Um, so it says how to use this in the instructions. It says apply as part of your skincare makeup prep routine every day. Squeeze a small amount on of product onto the applicator. Gently buff, oops, gently buff products into lips into a circular motion. Do not squeeze too whilst buffing. Let the serum absorb fully before you apply other refined lip products. It's very cheeky. I like it when they do that. Going when they like layer on top with more of our products. Even though I literally own most, I literally own all refined lip formulas and most colours and all formulas. So they're allowed to glow. So this is the Refi lip mask. Um, let me get you the lip balm. So it's darker than their normal lip balm packaging. So this is the Refi lip balm. Um, you get thirteen pill. You get thirteen mils of the lip balm, and then eight mils of the lip buff. So it's still like in their like grey neutral colour theme, but it's nice. I like. I just like everything Refi. So let's have a look. Oh, it's not a pull open, it's a twist open, if you guys care. And this is the applicator. Oh. It's like very interesting. I've never seen an applicator like this. It's plastic, so at least like things won't get stuck on it. I thought, oh, the applicator is plastic, which I like. So I think like after each use, you can just wipe the applicator so the dead skills and everything's removed and it kind of like reduces bacteria buildup. But let's squeeze some product. Ooh. It goes back in. Interesting. So I'm gonna squeeze some. And then I'm gonna like apply it to my lips. Let's take a before shot actually. So this is my lips before. Now, so I've squeezed them out. Oh, uh, hi. I'm applied to a bottle. Uh, applied. I feel like the product is hard. It's very liquidy, the product, so it's kind of hard to um, 
that and that. It's a bit watery, so it kind of, it's not thick enough to like squeeze and then put on your lips because I feel like it's very running, so you kind of have to press put it and then massage with it. I'm gonna It's not the most appealing thing to see me do is that. I could definitely feel it be smoother. I could do it if you take this is just my bottom lip. Now the top lip. So I'm gonna squeeze, get a whole lip, and then I'm gonna do the circular motions it's asking us to do. I feel like it kind of like lightens my lips as well. The science behind it, I do not know. That's kind of gross. This is all the dead skills that's picked up. So initial uh, reaction is that it kind of like evens the tone of my lips. Do you guys agree? Definitely has nourished my lips and got rid of the. It definitely has nourished my lips and got rid of all the dead, flaky skin. But I feel like you still need to apply lip products on top of this. Like, this is not a one and done go kind of product. It's, it's definitely like a pre makeup step or the last step in your skincare routine. You cannot just go back. So I, like, because you cannot go out like this because I feel like it's just like moisturizes your lips but it doesn't like do like what lip balm does it's definitely a lip exfoliant more than a lip balm you definitely have to wear like lip balm on top of this but it kind of is, like i think it's like a good base because it doesn't feel dry it kind of eases my lips if you guys want me to do a wear test just so um you guys can see how long it lasts please let me know i'm so sorry about this lighting um i'll improve it for my next video have a lovely day.